Uh, if I change from proof of work to proof of stake, I obliterate, I murder all the miners, right? All the Ethereum miners got wiped out. Billions and billions of dollars of economic damage. Did they get a say in it? No. Well, if they didn't vote on it, why is it happening? Because the programmers control the protocol, not the miners control the protocol. Yeah. It, if a bunch of people could get together and vote to make all of the wheat in Asia non-edible, it wouldn't be a commodity. <laughs> Right. If I could actually, if I had a switch where I could change a program and make all your electricity not work in the in in the UK, it wouldn't be a commodity. It would be a security. And I think Gensler's point is from an ethical point of view. If one group of people get to turn off or turn on the functionality of the entire system for the rest of the world, then the investors are relying on the efforts of others. They're relying upon the group that controls the protocol. And if you're going to actually be able to turn off or crank up the staking yield to 10% or crank it to zero or lock somebody up for a decade or give half the people, what if I just give myself all the tokens and I give you none of the tokens, right? I make yours not spendable and mine spendable. If you have that kind of power, you're running a company. It's a security. 